reasonably clear skies, a high haze still, but no serious weather problems. We're waiting for the launch of Apollo 13 with some 21 minutes and 25 seconds left in the countdown before the launch, scheduled for 2.13 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We had some reference earlier today to the number 13 in this uh, flight. It is taking off at 2.13, it is Apollo 13, and they'll be the 13th and 14th and 15th men to go to the moon. Uh, so, but none of them seem concerned at all about the numerology involved. Uh, the uh, launch, all the countdown is going well, with Jack Swigert now in that little command module pilot seat instead of Ken Mattingly, who be coming down with the measles. We're going to have a new voice of Apollo here for the launch phase uh, at the uh, Cape today. Chuck Collinshead, uh, who has been the deputy to Jack King, is taking over the voice job today. Jack King uh, wanted to see one of these launches from outside. It's a temptation, I guess, for everybody who's locked in the control room uh, during, the, uh, during the launch. So Jack King is uh, out at the uh, press site uh, to see for the first time, uh, other than on television, the launch of an Apollo uh, spaceship. And we're going to be hearing from, instead, Chuck Collinshead, who's been drilling long as the backup man to Jack King, as the voice of uh, launch control. We ought to hear an announcement from him just about now. This is Apollo Saturn launch control, T minus 19 minutes, 59 seconds and counting. Now it's passing the 20 minute mark in our countdown, and the spacecraft test supervisor has indicated that they're running just slightly ahead of that in their countdown. The command module pilot, Jack Schweikert, is now pressurizing the service module reaction control system. This is the system on the service module, which consists of four quadrants with four engines each. Each one of these develops 100 pounds of thrust.
Saturn V building up to 7.6 million pounds of thrust, and it has cleared the tower. This is Mission Control Houston. We appear to have a good first stage at this point. Flight Dynamics Officer says the trajectory looks good. We show a one half mile in altitude at this time. Five seconds. Booster reports. We are go. All four engines remaining, uh, looking good. Thirteen Houston, you are go for staging. Thirteen Roger, go for staging. Staging. And S four ignition, Houston. Apollo 13, uh, Houston, near go at 11 and a half, and predicted cutoff time is 12 plus 3, 4, over. Understand 12 plus 3, 4, predicted cutoff time. That's affirmed. Seco. Copy Seco, Jim. We're looking at the diski. Roger. Apollo 13, Houston, you have a go orbit all sources, and the booster is safe, over. Go orbit and the booster is safe. Thank you, Joe. Don't mention it. Apollo 13, Houston, uh, your preliminary orbit down here is 102.5 times 100.3, and everything is looking good. Roger, Houston, and it looks good to be up here again. I'll bet. <laughs> 